Obi Atiku Kwankwaso discussing merger to wrest power from the APC. They are hopeful that the election tribunal will call for a re-election or rerun, which will see them merge to challenge Balamed Tunubu. Gearing up for possibilities as the country continues its transition process, the trial of Atiku Aubakar, Rabiu Kwankwaso and Peter Obi have begun to discuss the possibility of a merger with the ultimate goal of setting up a formidable party that can more effectively challenge the ruling All Progressive Congress, APC. The meeting of these three political leaders, which have been going on for a while, it was gathered, started with the one between Atiku, the presidential candidate of the People's Democratic Party, and Kwankwaso, who was the presidential candidate of the new Nigeria People's Party at the last presidential election after the first leg of the meetings was adjudged successful. Another one between Obi, the presidential candidate of the Labour Party and face of the obedient movement and other critical elements in PDP started to take shape after the two stakeholders agreed to bring him in. The discussions which were said to be at the preliminary stages had been hinged on two pillars. The first, according to insiders, the three leaders have decided to wait and watch the outcome of the election petitions in court, which would determine the second leg of the decision should the court verdict go south. For instance, sources private to some of the discussions hinted that the leaders were hopeful that the election tribunal would be just and fair enough to establish that the election that brought President Bola Tinubu to office could not stand any decent electoral tests and as such do the needful. By this, the, leader, the leaders were said to be hopeful that the tribunal would call for a re-election or rerun, which would see them come together in a merger for the election and challenge Tunubu and APC in a second opportunity. However, if the tribunal decides otherwise, the leaders were said to be considering setting up a formidable party ahead of the 2007 general election during which they plan to take over the reins of power from the ruling APC. The bone of contention will be who is going to lead the merger. Many believe that Obi shouldn't be part of the merger because he is a step ahead of them.